What is going on, Libra? Welcome back to your weekly reading. We're going to do a Spirit Says message, all right? Before we get started, guys, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. I truly appreciate it. It helps out the channel. Um, to all those who are new and dig the vibe, I hope you subscribe. If this is more than your second time, you are a part of the Soap Tribe. You should have been subscribed. Everybody, make sure your notifications are on so you know when these videos premiere. If your girl happens to go live, I do op I do open. Whatever. I am open for personal readings. Mercury Retrograde, been trying to catch me, but whatever. Okay. But, um, yes, you can book on my website. That's listed in the description box below. Okay. Um. Libra, what I, and getting the decks together and pre-shuffling your energy, just make sure you stay and prayed up, taking your spiritual baths, charging up your crystals, whatever it is for your protection layer, praying harder, okay, being in deeper meditation, just stay all the way prayed up and like, <coughs> hell yeah, <clears throat> keep your protection up this week because somebody, mm, Somebody could be coming in with some sort of scheme or scam. I mean, somebody could be trying to come in and block some sort of proposal that becomes... Somebody could be trying to come in and sabotage some sort of plan somebody could have for you or plans you have. Okay, somebody could be coming in and trying to offer you, like, something that seems like a good idea and reality is really not. Like, read the fine print, okay? We in Mercury Retrograde. Make sure you read them fine prints when you get ready to sign them contracts and stuff, okay? Make sure there's nothing that's going to come back and bite you in the ass. All right, there's a lot of gossip and rumors going around, a lot of slandering, okay? Somebody can have a finger, hand, or a wrist tattoo. I tell you that much, okay? So, let's see what signs of placements are in your energy. Yeah, Saturn, karma is taking place. We got Pluto, okay? The house of hidden secrecy, okay? Capricorn, yeah, somebody's doing some demonic shit, okay? Let's see, divine holy spirit. What signs and placements are relevant for Libra to know about that are involved with this reading for this week? Or whenever you catch it, guys, time is fluid, okay? It's just a weekly read. Spirit says message. Signs and placements Libra need to be aware of. Mars, somebody bringing you conflict or tower. Aries and Scorpio energy. We got Mercury. Yeah, Mercury retrograde. Somebody from your past trying to come back and do some shit. Let's see. We got Gemini. Virgo underneath the deck, magician energy with them together. We got Mars though, 17, 2017. Somebody's birthday could be in June or March with this three here, six on a Virgo. Said about friends, family, people of your past. Then what is six house? Like your health or some shit like that, I think. Seriously. Mercury, yeah, six. Somebody could be like spreading rumors and gossip about your health or something like that. Somebody's birthday could be on the 15th, the 17th, the 3rd, or the 6th. Somebody's birthday could be in March or June. Something about 2017, 2015, 2003, 2006. Somebody could have a 15-year-old or a 17-year-old. Something's taking place in the next three to six days is what I'm hearing. Yeah, somebody's really trying to bring a tower to your doorstep by lying on you or some shit. Or trying to, somebody's trying to craft up a story. Or like I said, trying to bring in, like, make some sort of offer to you. But it's, I don't know, I'm hearing like co-defendants. Somebody's trying to get you caught up in something illegal. Somebody's, somebody trying to mess you up. Somebody trying to mess you up. Let's see. Yeah, we got a divine masculine. I could be talking to a divine masculine. Look, legal situation is 30. Somebody's trying to get you caught up. Yeah, what is this? Death magic. Ooh, child. I said, ooh, baby. Fatal attraction. Bay, I love you. Work, labor, efforts, 38. Mm. What we got, Spirit? What's going on for Libra this week? The only card that I really will take in reverse if it come out that way is the damn North No South No card. Something about real love. Look, 1551. I wanted to say 5150. Somebody's fucking crazy. 1551, though, 66. Six. Route 66. But somebody is crazy. Somebody's upset. Somebody's trying to stop you from moving forward. Like I said, somebody could want to come in and make a higher level um, a proposal of higher commitment to you. Want to take things to the next step. But somebody's back here doing some sort of voodoo to stop this shit. Yeah, change. Somebody wants to change this. Stop this. Nine. Hermit Energy. Virgo. Virgo's right here. Mm-hmm. Soulmate. Somebody's trying to stop some soulmates from coming together. So it's either take somebody out or get somebody locked up. They trying to do whatever they can to keep 
these two people separated, these soulmates from coming together. What is this? Yeah, Ice King, 42. Um, that's like the King of Swords here. So Aquarius, um, Energy, Gemini, okay, Libra. But somebody's trying to change somebody's mind. That's another six. 42 breaks down to another six. Somebody's trying to change somebody's mind. A rich, a rich guy here. Like I said, somebody could be coming in and trying to make an offer here. I could talk to a divine masculine. Okay, be wise. Somebody wants your lady. I'm hearing as well. Um, I don't know if you are like the ice king, like the kingpin, or like you're you're the big man on campus or whatever. Or like you run the streets or you run things, or like I don't know, you got your own business, or you're you're the ladies' man, you're the top pick. There's somebody who's close to you in your corner or something, or somebody who's going to approach you and try to get up in your circle who ain't no good. They're trying to get you set up and locked up and put away so that way this union don't come together. This is going to be somebody who will try to come and act like they want to work with you, but they're really trying to set you up. I'm hearing feds. Yeah, surprise. 14, Sagittarius. How did I know that, bitch? Because I do. God told me. Yeah, somebody's definitely trying to bring this tower, this five, this major change. Yeah, with a false contract, one on one. I'm telling you, read the fine print. Somebody trying to get you caught up on some shit. What's real love? That's what it was. I ain't even supposed to be even doing all. Oh, that's what made it. Yeah, somebody's trying to imprison this. 29, 11, keep this locked up so that it doesn't happen. Somebody's trying to block it. Yeah, they're evil lying at 85. Somebody's really trying to stop this. They're trying to put the masculine energy in jail so that way this couple can't come together. They're trying to get them caught up in a really bad scheme. What's 51? The voodoo could be getting done to like put the, put the masculine in jail and like even knock off the feminine energy. Yeah, the rich girl. I'm telling you, they're doing a voodoo on the rich girl, on the feminine energy. And then they're trying to send somebody in to set up the masculine energy to put him in jail. Yeah, look, it's a karmic masculine who's doing voodoo on a divine feminine energy, okay, or a rich girl, because he don't want to see this person move in, like move on and be with this ice king or this divine masculine or this person who, you know, this rich guy. I feel like he could be coming in or sending somebody in towards this guy to try to set him up to get him in jail. What's change? Somebody's trying to change your future and your destiny here, Libra. Yeah, a priestess, 72, that's another nine. Somebody could be enlisting a priestess, a high priestess, to do this work or to help them out or to get readings done or something like that. Yeah, to do this abuse, 54, 999, to cause this ending. Yeah, to stop this traveling, to stop this will of fortune, to stop this change from happening. 999, somebody's trying to create an ending. Smack that in the middle of your life here, Libra. What's Ice King? Somebody's about to be in for a rule awakening because his shirt say no hate on a surprise card. Somebody should have stopped hating. Yeah, somebody's going to try to come in. I don't know. Somebody's going to try to rob you, Divine Masculine. Okay. <laughs> Forty-two twenty-four. This is somebody who's trying to come in and steal your image. Um, I feel like I'm talking masculine, masculine here. It's a karmic masculine going against a Divine Masculine over a Divine Feminine. But the crazy thing is this, divine, this karmic masculine is on some well... I knock off this divine masculine and I take his title and I put this, I get rid of this divine feminine. Like I get rid of her too, since she don't want me. Yeah. 21 family. Somebody's really trying to come in and like, I'm seeing a movie face off with John Travolta and, uh, and Nicolas Cage where they had to face switch and then he ain't want to give him back his face, his identity, his family. It's that type of shit. Somebody trying to get you to sign some sort of contract or whatever to like, I don't know, be a stand-in or something like that for you, but then they're not going to give you what is yours or try to give you back like your title or your ranking. Yeah, like this is somebody who is trying to come in and steal everything from you and leave you on a, on a hopeless situation, like homeless. What's the surprise? What's the surprise? If I get one more, no. Yeah, somebody's about to be confused, shocked, and dazed, and stuck in an illusion. Because the surprise is it's not going to work. Because you're getting this warning. So stay prayed up. Say no. No new friends. Don't even hear, hear them out and then just gently say no. Like, let it go and walk away. Cause some, yeah, somebody, yeah, emotional pain. Somebody's about to really be fucked up. Because whatever little plan that they done worked out in their head. Whew, first off, it was a dumb plan. But secondly, it's not going to work. Um, Let's see. Mm. Faith, believing God's promise. Keep your faith strong this week. That's what I'm saying. Stay prayed up. Stay like up your protection. Make sure you're walking like entirely in your faith right now.
because somebody is really trying to test you. Yeah, they drive by your home. Okay. My bad, I meant to write this down. Who is that? Mars, Gemini, Mercury, and Virgo. Yeah, they're watching. Like somebody's trying to keep tabs on you. They're tracking your times. Public Defender, I'm telling you, they're trying to get you set up. Somebody's trying to set you up. They're trying to get your schedule down so that way they can try to like fuck up your alibi or put leave you in a sticky situation. We got a dark witch, a white witch. Classic that I fell over. So you have somebody in the light who's helping you, but somebody in the dark is also trying to work up against you. But you have somebody who's like low-key, a white witch in the background who's like helping you, trying to protect you in a situation. You're a diamond and a rough girl. Mm -hmm. Never been a local joker. That's what I'm saying. Like You could be like well-known or something like that. And this person wants your crown. Like, they want your attention. They want what you got. They want your lady. They want your family. They want your lifestyle. I done did a lot just to live this here lifestyle. Came from the bottom to the top of this lifestyle. Yeah, karma's a big bitch. It's coming in hot and heavy for this people, this person. All right, Divine Holy Spirit, what do Libras need to know in regards to this message? Spirit, what do they need to know? Almost doesn't count. Telling you, they're trying to set you up, trying to put you in a fraud situation. You're getting a message. Listen to your intuition. What else? What else do they need to know? What else do Libra needs to know? Whatever they're trying to do is not going to work. You just make sure you're doing your part. Don't get caught up in no BS. I won't even surround myself with new energies this week. Simply because it's Lionsgate and all that. Yeah, they trying to set you up. They trying to use all the energy that they got in this week. And this week got a lot of powerful transit, transits and portals and stuff like that. Yeah. What else do Libras need to know in regards to this for this week? Divine Holy Spirit, what else do they need to know? I'm wrapping up a karmic cycle and then I'm coming straight to you after I heal. Yeah, and that's why this chick is upset too. Yeah, they're tracking IP addresses with these people, okay? I don't know if they got some sort of scam or something. Yeah, stabbing. They're trying to betray you, stab you, hurt you. Aquarius could be involved here, okay? Or some sort of communication. They're trying to get you caught up on the phone, like saying something or get you implemented in a case or something like that, okay? Yeah, you can have a daughter or there's a daughter involved. Don't worry. They do this behind you because they can't get ahead of you. You're receiving a download. I don't know. Maybe a daughter is 25 to 34, okay? Or maybe you have a daughter, okay? Or maybe whoever this is has a daughter, okay? But you're receiving a download about this person. You could have knew this person from when you, like back in your late twenties. Maybe you ran the street with them or something like that. And maybe you know you just grew up. You you stopped. Maybe you had a kid or something, and you was just like, nah, I ain't gonna do this no more. Maybe a daughter helped kill you out of you know a lifestyle that you were living in. Okay. You realize you can't betray your family, but somebody wants you to come in and betray your family or make it so that you're not around for your your kids or something like that. You also could have received some sort of message or a dream. There's a recurring dream that could have been happening since you were about 25 years old and you keep having the same dream. You're trying to figure out why it's happening now. It was preparing you for this moment, for this day. 21, world card energy, Capricorn, fixed energy, Leo, Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio, 14, Sagittarius, 9, Virgo, 12, Pisces. <clears throat> you can see in 15, 51, okay. 11, 11, 1, 1, 1. 221, 42, 24, 999. Well, I need to put that on here too because who are the odds that y'all get that number, huh? Let's see if we can get some characteristics. Somebody can have a thigh or a leg tattoo. Somebody can have an eye patch. It could be temporary or permanent. I don't know. Do rag, wave cap. That's what I said. Yeah, somebody can rock a do wave or a wave cap. Wave, wave cap. 
somebody with like natural makeup or natural style, style like not a lot of makeup minimal makeup somebody could have a side of body tattoo okay a couple characteristics here for the people involved around a libra or if the libra needs to know if they're involved this could be yours too somebody has acne Somebody could like always have their hair in like a random color, like they dye it or maybe the wigs or whatever they wear, but it's not like their natural color. They like random colors like purple, green, yellow, like true reds. Somebody could have a tattoo on their butt. <clears throat> yeah, this could be the person who, wear, who, who wears like minimal makeup. They still natural makeup. I don't know. They could have the acne too. What else? What other characteristics? I like when you do me like that. Somebody can have a bat tattoo. Somebody could like rocking Nikes. Somebody can have a large nose. Somebody is below five feet. Somebody has dark brown eyes. Somebody could have a chin dimple or a booty chin. Somebody has one eye, yeah, the eye patch person. Somebody has an ankle or foot tattoo. Somebody has a lot of tattoos, a lot of them. Timberlands, okay, could be relevant. Okay, somebody likes rocking snapback or fittings. Somebody has gray eyes. Somebody has oily skin, person with the acne. Somebody likes rocking bandanas. I don't know why I'm getting like thug type of energy, like gang member. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody has short nails. Somebody rocks coach, likes wearing coach. Okay, somebody has natural nails. These last two. Somebody wears pack sun. Somebody rocks Chanel. And again, it's natural makeup look. Somebody rocks a natural makeup look. All right, not bad, Libra. Uh, let's see. Let's expose your haters for this week. Child. <laughs> it's like, hey, it's trying not to be exposed. Causing fights and chaos in your love connections. Mm -hmm. So if somebody wants your lady. Causing you to lose your appetite. Somebody's trying to kill your drive, your hunger, your motivation, your hustle. Yeah, your closest friends hold grudges against you. Told you. These people in your circle, in your camp. Somebody, it's like, you know, when you see those gangster movies and stuff, you know, you always got that friend who's been rolling with you, and all of a sudden, one day, a Springer Bell, I don't know, somebody could be from, what's that, Baltimore, The Wire, Springer Bell, is given that, like, eventually, he just wanted to take over everything from the Barksdales, like, he betrayed his homie, like, this is that type of vibe, like, somebody willing to betray you, like, keep your protection up this week. Like, they trying to do it at all angles. I cut for y'all. I ain't cut for nobody else. It's a wrap. That's what I got. This person hating on you has narcissistic behavior. Divine Holy Spirit, expose the haters here for Libra. You need to take a spiritual bath. I mean, that came out for, like, everybody. Seek someone to perform or learn how to do a court curtain ritual. Yeah, because somebody's trying to get you bind to a court case. What death magic is shit. Somebody's trying to injure you. Person causing negativity is an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, or Venus. This is a trickster spirit person that you're dealing with as well. Somebody who will steal from you and then help you look for what they stole from you. Okay, like I said, somebody in your camp. Okay. Possess an amulet and have it blessed with protection. I'm telling you. Okay, I don't know if you got a lucky rabbit's foot. If you need to carry you around, like pray over, get you an elder to pray over a mustard seed and you you carry that or something. It's crazy. This is mustard color. I said that. They secretly keep tabs on your every move. Okay, because, yeah, you need to keep your faith because, child, let me tell you something. They're claiming credit over your success. Yeah, this is somebody that you were working with, like you were in a team with. And they about to come and say, oh, yeah, I got a lick, da, da, da. Nah, but it's to set you up either to get you murked or to get you locked up. They're posting things directed towards you instead of coming towards you directly, okay? You know who this person is. I told you, there's somebody in your camp. There's somebody close to you, okay? 
Somebody could be a part of the LGBTQ community. Okay, you could be seeing rainbows as well. Yeah, they're remote viewing, always looking into your life. Okay, little do you know this person probably into like spirituality a lot deeper than you know. They get readings and shit down and trying to track down your every move. Yeah, this is a copycat energy. There's somebody in your camp who want to take your crown. But this person don't know how to make the same boss moves that you make. Jupiter retrograde to show up. Yeah, and they keep trying to cause fights and, and stuff in your love connections and just in your connections in general. They're trying to fuck up your camp. Yeah, they hate on your body image, your exercise routine. They hate your lifestyle. They hate you. We saw Virgo energy up here. They're trying to take you out. Yeah, they want you on an unexplained freak accident. I'm telling you, they're trying to set you up. Somebody is trying to set you up for a red rum. Okay, black obsidian. Yes, you need this. Be protected. Be protected because somebody is out to get you. Like, pew, pew. And I know what I put for a title, but... This is a red rum alert. Like, somebody is trying to set you up. What up? I don't personally know you, but I've picked up your energy before. What's going on? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta lay low, bro. Or something like that. Yeah, somebody in your camera. And you know who it is. Don't be, don't fuck with that person like that, man. They, they on that type of timing, man. That, it sucks. I'm hearing childhood friends, somebody you grew up with. Like, they was the closest in your camp. I mean, I'm hearing it was only a matter of time, though. It was only a matter of time. It's like this person's always been jealous of you, had envious eyes. All right, close this out. Oh, y'all got two. It says, accept where you are at this moment in time. Only then can you begin to move forward. Be clear about your intentions. This makes us easier. This makes us easier for us and the universe to help you. Doors will open unexpectedly. Be ready. Look past what you feel are your incapabilities. Instead, focus on everything you have achieved so far. It is okay to acknowledge your weaknesses. But keep in mind that they don't define you. Your strength and your beautiful soul are clear for all to see. So yeah, you trusted them. That was your homie. You know, you broke bread, but whatever. You know better now. Like you know you 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 know. So don't feel bad. Don't don't don't. Like don't. Count all of your blessings, even the small ones. Show gratitude and appreciation for all that you have in your life and all that has yet to come into it. The best days are still ahead of you. Isn't that a wonderful thought? Okay. So, yeah, don't, don't. That's all I'm going to say. Don't, okay? So, Libra, that has been your message. I really hope it helps. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as always, I love your face, but not as much as I love you. So, until the next time we speak, peace out.